Hi and welcome back to learning about the Havermal. Today we are on stanza 7. As always I'm going to show you what it says and then I'll give my interpretation and you'll be free to give yours. The knowing guest who goes to the feast in silent attention sits. With his ears he hears, with his eyes he watches. Thus wary are wise men all. So this is basically teaching us how the wise get wiser. It's um, it's telling us to not only listen, but to look. Pay attention to what people are doing around you. Pay attention to what they're saying. And also, when you're watching them, pay close attention to their mannerisms as well. It can teach us a lot by just being quiet sometimes. For example, if you were to go out and have dinner with somebody, just to get to know them, and they randomly speak to the waiter like crap, you know in that moment that that person isn't a very nice person. And if they feel comfortable speaking to a stranger like that, they're going to speak to you like that at some point as well. And if you're in a group of people... <clears throat> And the conversation is kind of very negative, like they feel comfortable with talking badly about other people, you know they're not particularly very trustworthy. Whereas if the conversation is very positive and they say good things about people, you know that they're going to be trustworthy. And I personally believe that who you choose to have as your friends is a huge reflection of who you are as a person like if you don't want to be seen as a bad person don't hang around with bad people if you want to be treated with respect be around people that are very respectful and also pay attention to the level of conversation are you in the company of somebody who's very intellectual do they know a lot more are they very wise what can you learn from this person and this is one of the reasons i actually love spending time with my granddad because um he's a lot older than me he's a lot wiser than me he's got more life experience and i learn a lot from my granddad and i absolutely love that so always always pay attention to the people that are around you always know when to speak and when to listen and with that being said I'm going to leave you now with a little saying that actually came from a film but I think fits perfectly with this stanza and that is the loudest person in the room is usually the weakest you can't possibly ever learn anything if all you can hear is your own voice bye